Okay. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Hope everyone's doing well. Just going to give it a few more seconds before I actually start this. Just got to make sure everything's in place. <clears throat> Okay. I think I have got everything in place that we need. Keyword, I think. Hey, what up, Maestro? How are you doing this evening, good sir? So you did something today. What did you do? What did you break? What did you break? What did you steal? What did you overcome? What did you conquer? What did you lose? Oh shit, okay. And how'd it go? How did you come along with the Cobra Lash? I failed, as we determined last night. I failed horribly. <laughs> You're 300 divs deep and I think it's safe to say you can't do it. Holy shit. So there's a possibility that when I decided to use Cobra Lash as the main skill to focus on, that there was a, a failed endeavor from the get-go. <laughs> nice. So I'll revert back around to you now. This really wouldn't be the normal introduction. So welcome to the stream, everybody. Make yourselves at home. Sit down, relax, grab some snacks, and enjoy. Help spread the word. It really, really would mean a lot to me. Share it on your social media. Media? 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 Share it on your social media. Get the word out there. Let's help grow this community. Thank you so much for the support that I have received so far. And Maestro, as always, you're a legend. Good sir, that VIP slot is reserved for the day that we get there. Um, so, we have a change of plans for this evening. Last night's stream, I do want to apologize. It was an absolute failure. It was a flop. We tried to increase the Cobra Lash build. It failed. It fell off by around Act 8. Then we were going to move on to a detonated dead build, but I wasn't really feeling it, and we decided discussing a power siphon build. By the time we got to the power siphon build, we were already about two hours into the stream, and I wasn't sure about how to approach it yet. The path of building was not clear. There was a lot of stuff that I had to look at, and I think I have figured it out, but there's still going to be a lot of learning as we move along. So, that's where we kick off now. We are starting off with our brand new build. And that is going to be, let me just update the title. Power Siphon Build Part 1. Done. So, I've got the path of building open over here. There is a couple of things I'm not sure about. I've got an idea as to the skills that I need on what piece of gear those skills need to go on. I'm, the only thing I'm still a bit fuzzy on is what the gear needs to compensate for. Am I looking for elemental damage? Am I looking for critical damage? Am I looking for resistances? What exactly am I looking for on the gear? That's the only thing I couldn't figure out because the um, path of building wasn't very clear on that. And I need basically all uniques, <laughs> effectively. So without further ado, I think that's where we're going to kick off. Sit back, relax, enjoy. If you're in the chat, say hello. If not, well, I hope you enjoyed either way. Okay, Maestro, so I looked at Piri and Ninja to compare builds and stuff, and the items they have just to reach a couple of million DPS are insane. So it looks like it's one of those builds that it could be viable, it's just too expensive to do. Oh, and Maestro, you'll be happy to hear I am doing this in the um, actual league. So I'm going to be poor as fuck.
Holy shit, okay. 60 divines just for the claw. Was it a double claw or a single claw build? A uh, single glow with a uh, Makoti or whatever it's called. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, so while that's busy, maybe we could keep the path of building up over here. Um, one thing I couldn't find. Blah, 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 sorry about that. One thing I couldn't figure out, Maestro, on this power siphon build, what is the primary weapon that I am using? Is it a dagger? Is it a sword? Is it a um? Is it a staff? That's one thing I can't figure out just yet. So it's a wand, okay. Do I want to be running a double wand to start off with, or would I want to have a wand and a shield? Like a spirit shield or something. Okay, so it's two, two storm prisons. Yeah, I, I realized that that is like later on. But I just wasn't sure if that was the route to go to level early game. But no worries. Let me just grab a uh, running magnum. Chance to poison, freezing cold, say whatever. Requires level twenty four. Got you. Okay. Yeah, power siphon I can't do. So if I go back to the guide, um, I know that up until level twenty four, I am basically just using rolling magma. And then at level 24 is where I then switch over to the gems. And from what I was able to gather from the build, the way the build runs with the gear is on the helmet, I am running Sigil of Power, Inspiration, Frost Blink, and Frost Shield. On the gloves, I have got four active skills, Power Siphon, Volatility, Power Charge of Critical, and Awaken Lightning Penetration. On the weapon itself is Sniper's Mark, Mark on Hit and Immortal Call. And then it is on the shield by the looks of it. It is Vol Grace, Vol Discipline and Wrath. But that doesn't make sense. Why do I have a shield in this build? Uh, keep in mind Power Siphon is attack and not a spell. So until level 6-9 you won't be looking for spell damage. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, the, uh, let's go over to the items quickly. Body armor, boots, amulet, ring, one and two. The nice thing is Watcher's Eye, as well as the Lethal Pride. I already have those gems. No, I've got those gems in standard. I do not have a Lethal Pride or a Watcher's Eye in Affliction. 
Well, that sucks. And because my currency is very, very low, I am going to be picking up a lot of scraps just so that I can sell it off for all the shards that we can get. I'm also going to potentially try and um, over level quite a bit because I want to get to the level as quickly as possible. And now while I'm saying that, I don't know if I've got my regular there we go <laughs> we have the means to acquire said things that is good that is true good sir that is true I'm not going to focus on this lady as much as possible. I'm going to try and get away from her, and I just want to get to the waypoint, go to the tidal island, get the medicine chest. Yeah, that lady can fuck off. Nope, fuck off. Did I go the wrong way? Yes, I did, and I caught myself stuck. You have a couple of spare helmets ready. It is going to be one of those situations where the build is going to become powerful because you've got 90% of the shit lying around for me. <laughs> it's defeating the whole purpose, good sir, but no, fair enough. Thank you very much, as always. So, I think it was last night. Are we referring to this build that we spoke about? There's two versions available. There's a budget version, and then there's a ridiculously expensive version. The helmets that you are referring to, and that kind of stuff, all the uniques, is that the expensive version? The helmet is part of both. Okay, fair enough. I said I'm picking up absolutely everything I can at this point. Uh, let's just take that for now. Increase spell damage 10. I'll take that one instead. Because right now I'm using spell damage, so I'll just 
take that until it gets better. Maybe this time, if we do this properly, I might be able to actually pay for the stuff that you're going to give me. Some of it. <laughs> I will take that 100%. That's a nice little free quick mask. Uh, that's part of both. Very integral part of the build, and it's dirt cheap. Well, that helps. That I run, I'm doing full circles of this thing. I don't have the energy to try and run back to the, that thing now. Uh, we go there. Yeah, we go there. Yeah, and two quick silver flasks, nice and early. Um, Oh, what am I doing? Stupid mistakes, stupid mistakes, stupid mistakes. Do you but maybe by any chance have movement speed boots? If you were really nice, you would. You do not because you're a dick. It's okay. I'll forgive you. Okay, so what level did it say we have to be at? We have to be on level... Level 24. You're going to prep yourself some hard bread. I'm guessing you're referring to toast. <laughs> so level 24, we are on level 4, so guess what? Only 20 more levels to go, and then we can just start using Power Cipher. And what do you mean by you're going to prep yourself some hard bread? Double baked. Why does that sound nice? Ooh, I'm not gonna lie. Do you know how much I would give for non bread right now? A nice garlic non. Sniper's mark. I'm going to need that, so I can just as... Oh, no, sorry. Forgot. Didn't mean to do that. 
Sniper's Mark is a skill that I'm going to need later on, so I'm just going to throw it on right now and start leveling it. And of course, an Iron Ring. And a medium mana flask. Take that, replace that. Once again, just grabbing all the shit because I need currency. But I'm also going to try and maximize space. Maestro, screw you, by the way. Ever since you mentioned the double-baked bread, now I'm thinking of, like, non-bread. Ooh, with the garlic butter. Sorry, butter chicken. Okay, I'm officially hungry. Welcome back, good sir. Screw you, by the way, Maestro. Just screw you. Ever since you mentioned double baked bread, I've been craving. I've now got, just got uh, non bread on my mind. Okay, let's start dumping off the one stuff because I definitely want a that. Did you get your double baked bread? <laughs> nice.
Now, I don't know if you heard what I was saying, but the moment you mentioned that you're going to get yourself in double baked bread, like the first thing that came to mind was a fajita. And then straight after that, I started thinking of like a garlic naan bread. And then I was like, ooh, garlic naan bread with a, a butter chicken. Oh, what I would do for garlic naan bread right now for, with butter chicken. Nope, I want that, but I do want to keep this because that is a chromatica. What was that skill that I just got? That was coordination. So that was attack speed, cost speed, dexterity. Okay, so I was supposed to grab. Okay, so now we're going down. Yeah, I actually ended up making dinner tonight, and for dinner we ended up having a um, cauliflower and potato mash with a, um, it's like a stroganoff creamy sauce with um, a pan fried chicken. I made burgers today. You know, all you've achieved right now is just making me hungry. Like, I ate less than two hours ago, and I'm like, I'm hungry again. You with your damn double-baked bread and burgers and shit. You're a horrible individual, you know that, right? <laughs> Okay, I can't take anything. I can. Uh, bear trap, orbital storms, repost, contagion. You know what? I don't like um, magma orb. Magma orb. Rolling magma. I think I'm going to use the orbital storms and sparks build to get to the level that I need to. Uh, I do need frost blink, so I'll put that over there. I'll take that. Thank you. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'll take the mana over the life. Generation, we'll do that there. Replace rolling magna and elemental proliferation support. Right now, I'm going to put on almost no. Well, storms can go there, that can go there, and then I want sparks. What did you use to level today? Oh, and I picked up a sniper's mark, so I've just equipped it and I'm just leveling it because I know I'm going to need it later on. Hello, palm smite. What the fuck is that? I've never heard of that skill. Half damage, third damage, 90, 16, 5, you know, fuck it. Uh, that does 39, you put this on, that does 46. Yeah, that works. Yeah, you see, that's the kind of shit that I've got no idea about. Never heard of it before in my life. You get hollow palm from a small cluster jewel. Okay. One with nothing. Oh, hold on. I'll leave that now. accidentally licked it twice. No, it's all good, man. I just didn't get a chance to look at it the first time. 
So you can't have steel wielding while you are unencumbered. 40% more attack speed with melee skills when you are unencumbered. That's 40 to 20 shock. You can die. And then... Oh, that's interesting. So we're gonna switch you out for that one. So in Act 3, I had over 10k DPS. What the fuck, dude? Act 3. Like, that must have been the fastest that you've moved through any of the acts. Oh, I fucked up. What would you just die? No, oh, I fucked up. You know what, this is close enough. I know that's like kind of in the middle of nowhere and completely random, but it's it's close enough. So basically you have no weapon, no shield and no gloves. You deal a, um, a bunch of damage per 10 dexterity. It would be interesting to see that. So... It should be interesting to see how that one works. Oh, fuck. I did not mean to start this. But here I am. I suppose free levels, kind of. I don't want such big things. I want to make the most of my... Space. I'm not gonna even bother with that shit. I'm just gonna die. Thank you. Shields, let's take this, put that over there. Put this. Is my shield quiet again? Damn it, I forgot to put on the sound of the game again. Don't worry, we only went 35 minutes without that being noticed. God damn. There we go. Yeah, you, you see, that's the side effects of being a newbie and yeah I was ch checking making sure everything's in place just to realize it's not actually in place 
Fuck sakes. But thanks for letting me know, man. Appreciate it. I know that that thing was randomly in the middle of nowhere, but I kind of forgot to drop that. The portal when I was here originally. <laughs> Am I missing something? Blood of Depth's not supposed to be around here somewhere. Just need a oh, I found it. Catch my breath. That's a big boy. I thought there was a small one angry axe. Okay, let's do this fight. Choppy. You have movement speed. No, you don't. But you are significantly better than the boots I've got. So, swap them out. Uh, go there. Some gloves. Increased attack speed, energy shield, life regen, maximum mana, and cold resistance. Yep. Not bad gloves to start off with. Uh, that's it for now. Awesome. Wrong button, but I suppose that works as well. Managed to kill it. Yeah, so now we go down to there. And then we grab those three. And then we move across into those. Lovely. Ooh, sell shit, sell shit, sell shit. Still alive. Stay sharp out there. Uh, life nodes. I'm following this build step for step. I'm literally just following a path that makes sense to me. So bring this up over here. I am literally following this path all the way down here into those. Then I'm going to start going across, grabbing all of those up there. Then I'm going to go to there, go down to those ones, go across into those. And then I'm going to go down, grab all of those over there, and then start going up.
I said, I've got a, bit of, a little bit of reading on to like what this build needs. I went through the build and I'm just following it how I would interpret it the first time. If there's something wrong with the way I'm doing it, then there's probably something wrong with the way the world is described. Like I said, I am needlessly killing absolutely everything I come across, but that's because I'm trying to power level to get the power siphon as quickly as I can. So I am picking up everything. I am going to try and sell absolutely everything. Just need a moment to catch my breath. Really, really, really hope that this is not one of those situations where you need to like 80% of the game um, spec one way into the tree and then do a massive respec later on. Because if that's the case, then I'm probably fucking this up already. Because I'm literally just taking the full level 96 build and the complete the build and I'm just re-engineering it backwards. Greetings. Because there was no other option available for a skill tree to follow for the first 28 levels, for example. Farewell. What little help I get. While we live. We are blessed. Be nice, medium speed, done. Want that because that's a chromatic. That is giving fire resistance and increased movement speed. That's a one. I'll take that as well. I take. Leave me alone, fuck off. Okay, what have you got? You are nice, but you've got no movement speed, so no. Nitrogen resistance. Energy shields. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's fine for now. Yeah, we're done with that section. Let's move on to this shit. The Oculus Prison's a child's playhouse compared to this. They sure don't make them like they used to. I know there's going to be a lot of back and forth between the towns right now, but that's just simply because I am still trying to build the currency, so I'm just going to be going back and forth so I can sell all of this shit. Farewell. The tale of the Blast attack support, added cold, lightning damage. Would be nice. Hello. I think I'd rather go for that. Yep. Uh, are there any specific skills I should be trying to pick up early, Maestro? Seed of Power, Inspiration, Frost Blink, and Frost Chill. So the problem is, I don't know when a lot of these things become active. It's Frost Blink, it's Frost Blades. Okay. Seed of Inspiration. Nope. Nope. Okay, on to the next one. Power Siphon, Power Charge. Uh, I the book, uh, maybe Warbanger. Okay, well, banner is not something I've got access to right now. No concerns. Goodbye. Are you still enjoying your bread? No. You know what I just realized? I need to do the fucking ascendancy trials again. No. Well, I'm instantly upset. Good damage, increase global link. Yeah, fuck it. I'll take that. Yep. Good an increase of what I had. No, I've actually got finished. Nice. Okay, I've actually finished off the first six trials. Nice. I don't have to do it. I 
was about to be very angry. So what are you busy running at the moment? I see you want a new character as well. Just something. <laughs> are you working on one of your sneaky boards again? Okay, got charisma. Charisma's out the way. Uh, do I want that? I can't even check if I want that or not. And of course I went the wrong way. Not in there, just a little bit. Try and deal with that shit now. It's amazing when you don't take those early damage um, modifiers to spells. It's amazing how quickly your damage actually falls. Like, you realize by this point how little damage you've actually got. I'm gonna potentially want that just because it's better, but I'm gonna lose. That yeah, frostman got removed to there, that got removed over to that, that thing needs to go into that. Let's use this on this. Give me something good. Lighting damage, fire resistance, two life, increased physical damage, increased spell damage. You know what? Fuck it, it's better than that, so. It might be shitty colors, but I got a damage increase, so. Better than nothing. like a killer yet reeks of thaumaturgy if you like so maestro i think i've asked you this question before but i don't think we covered it or we did and i've just completely forgotten it your opinions on Pathway XL2. How are you feeling? Are you worried? 
Are you concerned? Are you excited? Do you think it's gonna be dope? Do you think it's gonna be shit? Looks slow. This means more places to stick a blade. I am worried about the I'm worried about the fact that they've effectively made your flasks Dark Souls flasks. They've effectively made it Estes flasks. You can have a finite amount, but you're only gonna be able to fill up at wells. And the reason why I make why I think I'm concerned about that is because if they've made a finite amount of flask uses, it means that they've had to balance the fact that let's say for example the the base is you could get five uses out of a flask. Okay. Obviously maybe there's room for upgrade, maybe there's room for improvement on those flasks. So let's say you can get ten uses out of it. And obviously each one increasingly can um, increase in the amount of value that it recovers. The problem is, is still, because it's a finite amount that doesn't refill based on how many enemies you kill, it means that they've had to balance it according to the flasks. Which is making me think that I don't think we're going to have the massive amount of mobs like we are currently used to, where there's these big open scrolling areas. Because, obviously, if you take damage, you're going to sip once, and you've only got four sips left. So I think they've had to offset it quite a bit. Which is making me concerned that, like you said, it's going to end up slowing down the game a lot. Or it's going to cause you to backtrack a lot to get to the different wells. I did not mean to use that. Actually, you can't use it. Clarity, precision, flame dash. Actually, do I need any of this stuff? Uh, snipers mark on hit. I know that the next day of smoke mine, siphoning trap, flame dash, precision. I'll just get clarity for now. Stay sharp out there. The sun. Goodbye. I just need a moment to catch my
Austria was supposed to get here. No, there is not. Okay, so I can now move on to this. That's my level. My level 12. Question. Do I want to be doing corrupted areas to potentially get hold of the wall? No, I don't because I can just use. Never mind. I'm being retarded. I can just use wall orbs, but I don't have. I don't, I don't have any wall orbs. You could get the Val Haste that you need. Where do I get that though? Does it tell me like what kind what I can get out of one of these runs? I'd rather get the maximum life. And let's start going up to that. Missed. I'll take that. Increased charges per use. 150. Yep. I'll take that. I'll take that. Ooh. Well, clarity and ball slam. What is the difference between a ball clarity and a ball slam? Oh, sorry, not the difference between a ball clarity and a ball slam. They do completely different fucking things. But, like, what is the difference between the normal clarity and the ball clarity? So, normal clarity costs an aura that grants mana regeneration 0 0.1 meters to radius, 4.4. So, 
kacau kan kita. Ah, uh, So I'd be correct in saying that I'd rather want to use this. No, but it's just souls pick no. No, I don't need to fight this lady, I'm just doing it because of being XP. I have now got the old flame. Okay, let's move this along. It's 28 maximum life, 39. It's an upgrade. question is, I am probably going in the wrong way. Yes, I am. So that's where I want to be. I'm being very stupid. Wait, did I actually find this over here? I did not. So I need to backpedal regardless.
This is unnecessarily tedious. But I want to kill them because it's XP. percent plus eight into maximum charges i will use that thank you plate based replaces a boring i think i want there and then a heavy belt i think i want there right now just need a moment to catch my breath Welcome. Hey. Farewell. Marvel, if you must take Okay, what am I looking for here? Voltec post, icicle mine, lightning trap, fire trap, voltage support, essence drain, bolts out there. Nothing. Farewell. Her graves the Take that and the last shit I need to grab is Based on an energy shield mastery. Every four seconds regenerate energy shield. Energy shield equal to one percent of evasion rating over one second. Okay. And then we start moving on to the next. Uh stuff, 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 so what do I want to do? Stuffs. She yeah, available to me now. Um, I have warp in it yet. No, I do not. What else do I have that I can see stuff traveling? Sniper's mark, mark on hit. Yep, just sniper's mark. Okay. Uh, immortal. Uh, power charge. Power siphon. I've got power siphon. I think need that. So, do I equip that now? Just level it or volatility? That and lightning strike, blazing salvo, and kinetic bolt. There we go. Uh, sigil. No sigil. No inspiration. Trust me, I've got. Don't have frost shield. Vol grace, vol discipline, and wrath. Grace, I know I can't get now. Almost 100% sure I know I can't get that now. And then. 
Ich hab den. Nope, nur zu merken, geht da irgendwie besser. Power Siphon and Venom Guy can go away. Do I want that? Do I need that? Power Siphon? I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. Uh, okay. It's go time. Got my tool socket and ready to schlep. Yeah, you're definitely going a lot faster than I am. So, I've got a question for you. I now unlocked uh, Power Siphon. So I've just put Power Siphon in just to start leveling it. But obviously I don't have access to anything else. I do just want to see if I can't buy a Hello. cold resistance ring. Uh, cold resistance maximum life. Yeah, I'll take that. What the fuck does Power Siphon actually do? No idea what Power Siphon still actually does. One K DPS already. What the fuck? See, I have got one hundred and thirty-two DPS. How you like that shit? Well, let's be honest, good sir, if we do any kind of, like, playing together right now, you are going to... I'm basically just going to run after you. Let's just keep going, then. I'm at 130. What or uh, what skill are you using to uh, level right now? Are you already using power siphon or are you using like over storms? Like what's causing 1000 damage? Smite. Ah. Like are you building the same thing or are you building something else? Nah, that's a stupid question. Why would you be building the same thing? You've already got a build, a power siphon build.
Okay, let's see how many times my veil kills me. And let me guess, you're already done. Let me guess, you like two tap two. Well, I didn't die. Lady of quality. Pretty she let herself go like that. Yeah, I can imagine you two tapped her. That is the difference between knowledge versus kids stumbling about trying to figure out what the fuck's going on. I'll let you decide which category you fall under. Oh, forest. Death has too many down. You fall under the twink category. <laughs> I fall under the idiot kid that's trying to figure out what the hell's going on. Not a kid, but in this game, I could just as well be a toddler. That, uh, I want that because that's chromatic, so that stayed regardless. Uh, that shit, so I can take uh, one more thing. Let's take the bundle. First painted down. <laughs> yeah, no, there's, there's not comparing you and my skill level. Not in any form or way. 
I have seen much closer. The end of I am. Travel far. I am a beast. Goodbye. You and me, the road. The fire resistance ring. It's better than nothing. Because I don't really have the currency to fuck around with anything else. What? Going? Okay, so I just finished off in town. I am now going towards the outfields. The old fields. So I'm still working my way towards the crossroads. have the health or patience to try and deal with I know beasts not now I could not be fucked 2k DPS now that's ridiculous bro I'm sitting on 170 but right now I'm not getting any damage increase none like all of my skills are going towards prepping for the switch I guess and that's why maybe I'm not liking it right now because right now I'm like very um, over underwhelming on damage but I'm hoping that that's just a side effect of early stages and then after level 24 it becomes powerful as fuck really hoping that's the case really hoping that's the case yeah and I'm aware that I missed it then I'll go back for the white beast soon more than willing to try it more than willing to try it. A little bit later once I figure out what the hell's going on with this build. So let's go down to there. And then next we grab this 20% less attack damage taken if you hit. Okay. Am I correct in saying that that's what this build focuses on? Like, in the beginning, I'm so busy trying to get all the other nodes that the build is going to be relatively weak until I do the switch. Because, I mean, like, right now, at this point, this, this is struggling. Just need a moment to catch my breath.
I want to check something with you quickly, Maestro. Wind Dancer. That's not something I want to grab right now. I feel like that's going to be a very bad thing for me right now, specifically because of that last sentence. 20% more attack damage taken if you have been hit by an attack recently. That just feels like it's going to get me dead specifically. Yeah. See, and that's the issue that I've got with this build path. Um, following a path of building that doesn't have a section dis description is because if I had just followed this without knowing what that was, without double checking, I would have grabbed that. So now my question is, the argument could be, if I was not supposed to take Wind Dancer yet, what else was I not supposed to take yet that I've taken? Something like Charisma? Should I have taken that? Elemental Perforation Support. Hold on. I'm not using that anyway. I'm not. But I'm level 18, so I'm almost there. I'm hoping that when I reach the required level, to actually start making the switch, that it actually has got a decent increase in damage. that because the intelligence requirement portal scroll the best mask Continue to go around this way. Luckily, this is giving me some kind of damage because, well, I'm using all the storms and sparks, so.
I'm not gonna waste my time with that. I'm really losing so much time trying to fight these fucking blues and leads. Like, I want to kill them because I know they're gonna give me the ex best XP, but I'm doing so little damage. Long to kill, yeah, definitely. Because right now I'm feeling it like it's bad. You are green. Specifically because none of the skills that I've taken so far have gone anywhere towards damage for me. Speak. Yeah, it's bad. Yo, hello. What troubles you? Yo, Okay, so I've got the first, I've got the hand. I think I'm now going to my first bandit. I haven't been focusing on anything really, I've just been trying to run to get the level. I haven't been focusing on gear, I haven't been focusing on jack shit. Velvet slippers. Take those penetrates. Okay. Once again, not sure how that helps me right now, but I hope everything I've done up until this point is actually going to benefit me. Okay, DPS. I'm on 177, bro. Your troubles. I am killing everybody, right? With this build. Uh, can't actually remember right now. Uh, 
start with shadow kill. Okay. There's a possibility that this little fight is gonna last a bit. Because you know my damage is absolutely fucking phenomenal and powerful. That was the longest fucking fight for absolutely no reason. I really hope that when we get to the required level there's going to be a decent increase. Okay, now the third route of the crossroads, then I need to go back to the den to grab the white beast. Just need a moment to catch my breath. I know I am not fucking with your beast right now. I am not interested in those beasts right now. This still makes leveling fun. I can imagine, dude. You are fucking going through your damages ridiculously quickly. Like, I'm sitting on 177 damage, and I've, I think I increased from 130 to 177, like, within the last act and a half. And that's what I'm saying. I don't know if I'm following this build correctly, because I'm following the path of building. This is what I've allocated so far. There's been, like, almost zero damage increases. All of this was dex, that was strength, that was dex. This is area of effect, increased mana reservation, as well as increased mana reservation efficiency of skills. Then some more dex, then there was evasion rating. Some more dex, and this is the first time weapon elemental damage. So I'm hoping, really hoping that soon, because I'm on level 20 at the moment, pretty soon I can switch over and actually start progressing quickly. I need levels. I'm not gonna bother with you. If they don't die quickly, I'm not interested. If I don't be careful, I'm gonna be the one that dies quickly. Not gonna bother with the yellow. Fuck it, that's the sanity trial. I'm not interested in going that way.
Is that the, the jewel that you're referring to that's making it so fun to level? Is that the one that you uh, linked to me earlier? with the ring. What ring is that? It's slaughtered everyone. Help me. Full of the void sapphire ring. Okay. I would like to have a look, but you know I first gotta like take ten minutes to kill this one thing. And then obviously die in the process as well. Intelligence increased cost. You know what? Fuck that. I am rocking these gloves for one reason and one reason only. Well, that did absolutely fuck all. Percent increased spell damage, 25% reduced cost speed, and 50% to intelligence. That's what it was increased to cost speed. Mm -mm. Damn it. Uh, let's have a look at the ring quickly. Thing that you sent. Call of the Void Sapphire Ring. 20 cent. 52% cold resistance. All damage with hits can chill. All damage can taken from hits can chill you. Enemies chilled by your hits can be shattered as though frozen. Enemies chilled by your hits lessen it. That actually seems like fun. I can imagine there's a lot of like frozen explosions on your screen. Hits have 25% chance to treat enemy monsters and with values inverted. Metal resistance values is inverted. Okay. Metal resistance values is inverted. Uh, okay, so that mastery is done now. We just continue down the line. Because apparently that makes sense. Uh, time for Act 3. Yeah, I just finished off the... Yeah, I just finished off the crossroads, all of those people. And I just gotta go back to the den, then I've gotta start the western forest. That's the difference in the speed. It's ridiculous. What do you want? Uh, Assassin's Mark. Held of Thunder would be nice, but apparently I don't have the intelligence. Held of Ice, Blade Blast, Arcane Cloak, Summon Skittlebot, Cold Snap, Arctic Armor. Held of Thunder, I'll just take it. Going? My help is yours. I'll keep those. I'll just get rid of that. Remember to live. What do you want? Travel far. I might need to rely on you to get me one or two of the gems that I need. Because I think I focused very much on overleveling. And yeah, I am on level 21 right now. And the area that I'm in is only like level 16, level 15, so I don't think I'm going to have access to the, the skills that I need until much later. But if possible, I would like to try and go into those skills as quickly as possible. Get off of this fucking magic bolt. Because I'm really struggling with damage right now.
Just need a moment to catch my breath. My damage has increased to 189. I mean, that's an ugly shit right there. The white flower. Mm. Just fuck with the maximum life. So, question, do I have to, like absolutely have to, wait until that point, level 24, before I can switch over? Is there a hard cap on a specific gem, or a specific thing, that is preventing me from getting that? That's all good. My question was, is there any specific reason why I have to wait 100% for level 24? Like currently I'm on level 21, but I'm getting very irritated with the fact that everything I've been building is, like nothing is giving me damage. Level 24 requirement, storm prison. Fuck, okay. Yeah, we'll just log it through and try and get the levels. I 
damn, that damage is terrible. I know, I can't deal with your creatures now as well. Killed. So very dead. Is that worth it? I got the stone prisms if you want them. Would be nice, can't use them. waypoint I'm not gonna fight that dude I just need the waypoint I'll come back for the guys on the top just need a moment I'm back in town. That's what I need. Thank you very much, good sir. Then comes the second issue. Okay, hold on. First, let me put these away so I don't accidentally sell them. You go there and there. Intelligence. Where do I get the fucking intelligence nodes? Because I do not have the intelligence to use this in the fucking slightest. I've got 43 intelligence. They require 83. Where... The fuck is intelligence? All the way up that way. Unless I grab this for the time being. Yeah. I'm gonna have to grab that one for the time being. You see, that's what I mean. It would have been nice to have some kind of like. Carnage hot. 
Don't know what a carnage heart is. Um, I think I'm going to grab that temporary 30. So that is 83. I have currently got 40. That 30, that's slowly going to put me on 73. I'll make up the difference somewhere on a piece of equipment. Hopefully. Hello. Well, before I can even think about doing that, I actually have to get to the right level. Which right now seems on its own to be quite a bit of a task. this question earlier but i don't think you are you answered because i think you're busy with your own building um is this the kind of build that you're supposed to spec into a certain thing up until level 23 and then respec or is this the kind of thing that you just suffer in silence and then it becomes powerful later on just need a moment to my once you do the switch over Oak. And I need to fight Oak with this abysmal damage. That's gonna be fun. 189 damage, here we go. So it is. Suffer, got you. Actually. I mean, he is dying, technically. There we go, he's dead. At last. area I gave the ebony piety journey I have story Now I just need to go kill the weaver and Tiki forgot her name That I'm not going to stick around yet. So I don't really have much of a choice on what my next upgrade is going to be. It has to be the intelligence. You just need a moment to catch my breath. 73, so I still need to make up seven intelligence samples just to use the ones. I 
forgot. It's more levels to go for that, so. I'll cross that bridge when we get there. Okay, Akira, Alira. Time for you to die. Okay, Akira, Yeah, she's Did dead. Earth move Fine. You, baby? Probably. You hit the ground quite hard. Now we just go back to the road and then we go diagonally across down to the bottom to the weaver's nest. And we deal with that shit. I don't want to know what it's going to be like fighting the weaver with us. Alas, we shall fight. We shall suffer. It wasn't too bad, and it gave me a nice little boost. Just need a moment to catch my breath. I think my goal for tonight is to at least, if I've got the time, at least reach level 24. And see if this thing is actually worth struggling my ass off just to get to this point. up with all the others. Okay, we use nest. Fucking finally. Oh, damn this damage is horrible. I've got a funny feeling I'm gonna die a few times in this fight. It's gonna be worth it, it's gonna be worth it. 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 Oh god, it's gonna be worth it.
Ah, tiene que salvarme. Master, you are officially responsible for my biggest nightmare at the moment. Just putting it out there. Thanks, Maestro. <laughs> There's good you say I am sure. Oh, thank goodness. At least I've got two of these now. Um I think I'm gonna ignore going down this one, I'm just gonna go that way. Increased attack speed would be nice. Daily elements, night play, trinity. I don't need any one of these, but I'll just take past the casting for now. Piety will automatic. Mm. What? So, 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 so. Return if you must. The nightmare that I'm having at the moment. That's what you're responsible for. <laughs> like, I'm looking forward to the point where I can switch over. I think it's going to be relatively soon. Because, I mean, I'm pretty much at the point of leveling up again. So that's level 23. Here we go. One more level, and then I'm on level 24. How's that me? I'd offer you leveling gear, but you don't want it. True. I think I'm trying to prove a point. I want to be able to tell myself, hey, I freaking did it. Rather than, Maestro came to the rescue again and gave me everything I needed. <laughs> because right now I'm struggling to get damage out there so that's done that's done that's done I can finally go to the top you do the heavy lifting and I sort out the admin I actually like the sound of that <laughs> I actually really like the sound of that Need a moment to catch my breath.
think I'm starting to reconsider that that leveling gear. I think I'm really starting to reconsider it. Oh god. Half a level, half a level left to go, and then I'm on level 24. How much of a change do you think there's going to be once I switch over to level 24? Once I actually make the switch. Tested it just like it. Okay, sweet. Well, hopefully, it's gonna happen soon. I'm almost three quarters of the way there. I'm like literally trying to kill every single creature that I can come across so that I can switch over to see if it does anything. Because right now, this 228 damage is, is bugging me a lot. Just need a moment to catch my breath. And of course I went to a dead end. Lovely. I don't want to go through there because I didn't want to fuck with that dude. So I'm going to go around. And I'm going to have no choice other than to deal with him now. So I'm going to ignore you. Trying to do a dead end, so I'm gonna die. I'm slow, I'm slow, I'm slow. Help. <laughs> Help. <laughs> Help. <laughs> Get to the big ball. Get to the big ball and just run. Shadow is starting to feel a little anonymous. That is stupid. I'm doing barely any damage over here. Okay. Northern Forest. Hopefully I can kill some shit out in the Northern Forest because right now I'm struggling. Like I'm struggling. Oh, no, fuck off. Now I've got to deal with Aino out here as well. Okay, actually, I know is good because I know can actually end up killing all the shit for me. I know. Where the fuck is I know? I'll take that. 
Just need a moment to catch my breath. I'm not gonna deal with that shit. Okay, so I've restarted this area. Hopefully, there's no. I know everything. Okay, fuck this. Fuck this. I'm not going any further. I'm not taking a single step further. Not a single fucking step. Not one. Level 24. Okay. I'm officially on level 24. What is the fastest way I can give myself some intelligence? Uh, buy a piece of gear that's got intelligence. What, what gives me intelligence? Uh, plus 16 to all attributes. Um, yes. Just that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Okay. Uh, stash. One. <sighs> Finally. Okay, uh, Maestro. What does do next? Unequipped all the gems that I had, and now it's a case of figuring out what I do next. So I've got power cipher. I've just put that over there for now, and I have got sniper's mock. I think that is literally the only pick up a tabby and a power siphon and start playing. A tabby and a power siphon. What's a tabby? BRB. Got you. Are you are you referring to that tabula rasa thing? Go with the spirit. I want to test this. What does this actually For do? All of her, the end of turning is the beginning of I don't know what this actually does. Uh, look at the forest.
It feels weird, but it automatically feels a lot better than what I had. Well, fuck me sideways. Okay. No question. Does it work by marking this? It does. Oh, would you look at that? That's really a day and night difference between what the fuck I had. That's actually, that's actually nice. That's actually very nice. Welcome back, good sir. So, I don't know what a tabby is. But I'm already liking this. This is already a lot fucking better than what I had. Tubby Russell. Yeah, I don't know where I'm gonna get one of those. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Wherever do you think I would be able to get hold of one of those? Good sir. actually have an honest question for you and that is more so as in moving forward now with the gear that i'm looking for what am i looking for on the gear am i looking for physical damage am i looking for because i know that this is oh, i'll read this that's not just this stupid thing So I know that the power siphon is a critical attack and projectile. So am I looking for gear now that has got critical multipliers, projectile multipliers? Looking for flat elemental damage and attack speed. What trouble? Okay. I've never in my life had one of those. That looks very, very nice, good sir. Thank you very, very much. But why is it corrupted? Like, what does corrupted do to Tabli Rasa if it's got literally no stats on it? 
Or is that just a flex? Okay. Now, question. When you refer to flat elemental damage, are we referring to specific types of elements, like shock, uh, li uh, lightning, fire, or ice, or any of them can get a plus two to soccer gem or even up to 50% increased damage? Now it does hold on, I need to have a look. Hold the lighting, I'd say. Okay, cool. So I need to seriously okay, so I'm not gonna touch those two. Uh, that's for my resistances, so helmet needs to be upgraded for sure. But now I can actually start having a look potentially at items that I need, so uh, So my helmet needs to have Sigil of Power, Inspiration, Frost Blink, and Frost Shield. So I need a 3 blue, 1 red for my helmet. 3 blue, 1 red. Well, I've got 2 blue, 1 red. And on there I need Sigil of Power, Frost Blink. Okay, let's put my Frost Blink up there. And Frost Shield. I do not have access to Sigil of Power, Inspiration, or Frost Shield yet, I don't Boy. think. Uh, frost, nope. Sigil, nope. And inspiration. Nope. Don't have access to that either. Okay, so on power siphon, that's on the gloves. I need a three blue one red again for the gloves. And for that, I need power siphon, which I've got. So power siphon actually needs to go into my gloves. Which means nothing right now because the gloves suck ass. Uh, volatility, which I'm guessing I don't have. Oh, yep, nope. Uh, power charge. Ooh. Power charge of critical support. Hey, I've actually got that. Oh, fuck me. I don't think I'd have access to that yet. And then awaken lightning penetration. Don't have access to that yet. Nice. Okay, and then I can put this in there to support it, right? Because they are technically supposed to be supporting each other. Because I don't have a waiting awaken lightning penetration yet. Then I need a Vol Grace, a Vol Discipline, and a Wrath. Don't have Wrath. It's an alternate quality gem. Don't search for it. Huh? Uh, what am I looking for then? Uh, lightning penetration. Overcharge support. Physical to lightning support. Kalvik. Arcane cloak. Herald of thunder and tempest. Wave of conviction and summer skitter bots. Okay, so I don't think I've got access to it yet. And then Vol Grace, Discipline and Wrath. No grace, so I can't use a ball orb on it, and no discipline either. Okay, so that's all I've got for now. Now, I've got a question, because on this thing, I have access to all gems. What do you need? Okay, I need a uh, sigil of power. Actually, let me do this. I'll just put that there. So those are the first four that I need. Let me know once you've got those four and then I'll show you the next one. Now I've got a good idea that a lot of these skill gems I'm not going to be able to use yet due to um, level requirements. So we'd like to at least have the skill gems that I need. In the meantime, while that's better, I'm quickly going to minimize this. I'm just going to sell off everything else. Uh, sniper's mark. I can 
Take you off. So I've got him. Okay, I'll show you what's next now. Okay. Uh, next is. Okay, so I've got power siphon, uh, volatility, power charge on critical I've got, and then awakened lightning penetration. So from this one, I only need volatility and lightning pen. Oh, did you already grab? Okay. The man already got everything I needed. <laughs> Thank you very much, good sir. Okay. Now comes the question that I've actually got for you. It's on this. Left column for power siphon. Left column for power siphon. Left column. I'm confused. So put the first four in your tabby. So power siphon. Oh shit, I don't know how they were in the thing. I think they've all just pulled through to my thingy. So I've got power siphon, uh, power critical. I think the added lightning damage. Okay, so I can't use that one, can't use that one, can't use that one. I don't have the level requirements for those just yet. crit chance and lightning damage myself okay so added lighting damage so I can put added lighting damage to you and then increase critical strike chance into there as well uh, frost blink I already got I'm not worried about frost blink Right, so these ones I can't use yet, so I'll keep hold of them and volatility support. Support is going to be more maximum attack damage. Okay, back to the question that I actually had for you. So on this one, why does it say that Sniper's Mark Mark on Hit and Immortal Core has to go onto the weapon if the weapons are all blue blue blues? Sweet. So I think what I'm gonna do is for now I'm gonna keep that. I'll keep the mark over there. Let's just go to the stash. And what I just wanna do is just for my own sanity. So I don't need to do something stupid. Uh don't know what those are. I'm just gonna put these over here. So I know that those three are ones that I still need to come back to. Lost blink that I need and sniper's mark, we have to read all the colours as well. Okay. Let's go back over here. Put this shit away. And let's run this and see what it looks like. Mm, okay, so my time on that already ran out, so we're gonna have to restart that. But it's okay.
Just need a moment to catch my breath. That's pretty. That's very pretty. I did do the right thing there, right? Mm, yes, I needed that. That's where Sniper's Mark would come in clutch, but that's pretty... I like this. Maestro, I like this. It's a day and night difference to the damage that I had. like this <laughs> I'm gonna say it about 40 more times I like this and it's just gonna get stronger and stronger and stronger I'm guessing I don't think it's gonna take very long to get stronger I don't have a sniper's mark, I'm not gonna waste my time trying to fight the big guys yet. I need the gems to level up a bit more. That was already a lot faster getting through there. Yeah, I'm also probably going to call it there. I'm just going to get to the next waypoint and then I'm going to call it for the evening as well. I achieved the target that I wanted to. Got past the horrible, horrible, horrible phase of... Um, of the... Where do we got the power siphon actually working? So I'm glad we passed that at least. Now we're at least onto power siphon and now we can make it better. I think tomorrow I'm going to rely on you to figure out how to make the gear better. Maybe not necessarily grabbing um, leveling gear, but more so just where my focus should be for leveling it myself. But I do at least now know that, like you mentioned, it is flat elemental damage that I want. And then attack speed. sustain that would be nice here because i'm currently burning through mana that's okay silk gloves diamond dream i don't need that don't need that i never need to pick up a chest piece again because i don't think i'm ever going to replace that chest piece however i do want it for currency uh so we'll just hold on to that for now mm, what does this do 
Critical strikes are increased right lady right light radiance. And also at some point we can start figuring out my resistances. Yeah, there is no waypoint before the boss fight. Oh. Well, that's irritating. Uh, which I should not go next. Oh, that's terrible to my board guide. Okay, so down would be for survivability. So we go down, we're going to suppress spell damage, and then the evasion rating. How is he dying? And lightning, increase critical, and boss blink. Okay, well, I think if there's going to be no waypoint before the boss, I think I'm not going to carry on too much further. I'm just going to go down over here. Actually, no, I need to select the mastery. And the mastery is monsters cannot block your attacks. I want. Grab that. That's a guaranteed hit every single time. And what I am going to do is I'm going to call it over there. So I'll just pop back to the uh, forest encampment. And we'll just sell off everything. What is that? That was frost blink. I've already got a frost blink. Okay, cool. Going. Let's dump off all of this. Okay, I think that is as good a place as any for me to then leave it for the evening. We'll continue with the boss fight tomorrow, and then hopefully from there we'll start picking up the pace. So in the last two hours and fifty-six minutes, I have done one and. Nine tenth of act two so let's say I've, I've done two acts in the last two hours three hours actually because it's two hours and 56 minutes so things were very very slow in the beginning over there um trying to get to the level 24 where we could start actually using these um storm prisons obviously thank you very much to maestro for having them available for me and then of course to the massive shout out for the tabula rasa that's exactly something that I would not have had the ability to be able to use if it was not for you. So thank you very much for that again. I appreciate you. Like always, the amount that you've done for the three builds, four builds that I have run is pretty insane. And it means a lot to me. And it will not, and it has not gone unnoticed and will not go unrewarded. That is for damn sure. But yeah, I think that's why I'm going to call it for the evening. Thank you very much for everybody that has tuned into the stream. I really do appreciate it. For those of you that are not aware, all of my past live streams do get posted onto my YouTube channel for your own viewing pleasure. So some support over there would be nice as well. Go subscribe, go um, like my videos and go turn on notifications. That way, if you want to view the videos later on, by all means, you're more than welcome to. I am going to ask you very nicely if you can help spread the word of the channel share it with amongst friends and family and on whatever social media platforms you have let's get some views inside here and let's try and get some more people into the stream and let's help me grow a little bit it would mean a lot but until then i hope you have a lovely evening and or day depending on where you're from look after yourselves keep safe goodbye and maestro good night my friend have a good evening further